Okay, in this video I'm going to show you how to customize the social media icons that show up at the bottom of your site. If we scroll down to the very bottom of the home page, you'll see uh, it says follow us and it has links to uh, several different things. If you want to have them on there, you're going to want to customize them to your own social uh, networking sites. Now the first one here, this is the RSS feed of your website. Um, it's not really a big deal. I mean, if you're if you're using your site as um, if you have a blog section, then you would want to leave that on there. If not, you can take it off. It won't really hurt anything. Okay, so how to do that? Well, let's go to the dashboard of our site. And for this, we're going to have to exit easy mode. So on the right up, upper right-hand corner, click exit easy mode. You can also find this on the left menu. If you scroll down, you'll see exit easy mode. So either one of those, click that and that will take us out of easy mode which essentially just opens up a lot more menu options over here on the left so what you want to do is scroll down until you see a menu item called white light and just click on that and when that opens up we have another whole menu over here now if you scroll down basically almost to the bottom you'll see one an item called subscribe and connect so click on that and that opens up some options over here on the right. So I'm going to scroll up to where we can see the top. Um, these things we don't really need to change, although if you notice on this site it says follow us on the following sites. You can see that text comes from right here uh, where it says text. So if you wanted to change that wording you could. Uh, let's scroll down. This is the option here for enable RSS. That's the l first little icon here. That's so people can subscribe to your blog if you had a blog. If you're not doing that again, you can take that off. So I'm going to uncheck that. Um, let's say, well, okay, we have Twitter, Facebook, and there's YouTube, Flickr, LinkedIn, some of these, So uh, and more. So just use whichever ones you're using um, and take off whichever ones you're not. So let's say that I wanted to... Um, remove Twitter because I'm not using it and I just want to leave Facebook and uh, LinkedIn so make whatever changes you want and of course copy and paste your your um, URLs for your social networking sites in here and when you're finished click Save All Changes and it'll say Options Updated now if I go over to my site and refresh it you can see it's changed. It says follow us on the following sites. I only have Facebook and LinkedIn now because I took off the other options. So it's a good idea to customize that so that people are, are following you on your site rather than just whatever was uh, set to by default. Now after you've made these changes uh, you can go back go back over here and the best way to get back out of all this stuff is just click back on activate easy mode and that will take you back to the dashboard and where everything is much simpler. <laughs> you can see there's far fewer menu options and uh, things to get confused by. So uh, that's how to customize the social networking icons on your site.